Hello, I'm Sianna, and I'm so happy today to tell you some stories of Hanuman. So a long time ago, the Lord Vishnu looked to the earth and said, okay, it's time to incarnate once more. And this time I will incarnate as Ram. And Vishnu's beloved Lakshmi, she said, well, if you're going, I'm coming too. So I will come as your beloved and I will incarnate as Sita. And so Ram and Sita are going to be incarnated as beloveds on the earth. Now, when Shiva hears of this, he goes up to Mount Kailash and he takes his perfect seat of meditation at the top of Mount Kailash. And as Lord Maheshvara, he closes his eyes and he goes into a deep, deep inner absorbed state. And he begins chanting, Ram, 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 Ram. And he's chanting Ram's name over and over and over. And his beloved Shakti starts to hear this. And so she goes up to the mountain and she says, Shiva, why are you chanting uh, Ram's name? Who is this Ram? And he says, well, Ram is Vishnu who's incarnating to be a, a leader of Dharma. And I want to go and assist him. And so I'm going to incarnate as a being called Hanuman, the great monkey god who will be in service to the Lord Ram and his beloved Sita. And so Shakti says, well, if you're going, then I'm coming too, because that sounds like so much fun. And so I will become the tail of the monkey himself. And she becomes the Kundalini Shakti, the twisting, turning, coiling, uncoiling play of the Shakti. And so Shiva and Shakti, they make love and they sing to each other. And then their love seed is released into the winds. And the Lord of the wind, Vayu, catches the love seed of Shiva and Shakti and he carries it with him and he carries it to the earth and he sees this gorgeous monkey named Anjani. He falls in love with her. He gives the seed to her and then she gives birth to the little Hanuman. Now Hanuman, when he's born, he, as far as he knows, he's just a monkey. As monkeys are, he's very playful and he gets into a lot of trouble. So he's running around and he has all these powers that he doesn't really understand where they come from, but he just takes them as they come. And one day he looks up into the sky and he sees this most delicious mango. And you know how monkeys are. They just, they cannot resist that kind of ripe, good looking fruit like bananas and mangoes. So when he sees this mango, he gathers up all his momentum and he leaps up into the sky and he Open, opens up his mouth so huge, but the mango isn't a mango, it's the sun itself. And as he opens up his mouth, ready to swallow the sun, the gods and goddesses get a little nervous because the sun gives warmth to all. And so they say, Indra, please do something. And at this moment, Indra takes his thunderbolt and he shoots it across the sky and it strikes Hanuman. He falls to the earth and his jaw breaks open and that's how he gets his name of Hanuman, the one of the broken jaw. But now as he's growing older in his monkey stages, he goes to his mother and father and he says, I really want to learn the mantras. And they say, well, the first place to go is to the sun, Surya. And since you had a little bit of trouble with the sun earlier in your life, we're not sure that he'll take you on as his student. He says, okay, okay, I remember, but I'll, I'll just, I'll, I have to ask. So he makes his second great leap to the sun. And as he gets up to the sun, the sun says, oh no, I remember you, no thank you. And Hanuman says, but please, I want you to be my teacher. I want to learn the mantras. He says, no, no, I have all this work to do from dawn till dusk. I have to carry this big chariot of the sun, you know, in this light and this warmth across the sky for all the world to be warm. It's hot. It's sweaty. I'm a little tired. I don't have time for a little silly monkey. And he says, no, no, no. I promise. I promise. I'll be the best student ever. In fact, you won't have to change a thing. I'll just stand in front of you. And then what I'll do is I'll run backwards all day long in front of you. And you just do your work and teach me as you go. And so the sun can't resist and becomes his teacher. And Hanuman 
then goes on to become this great ignited being of mantra and yoga, but most of all of deep, deep service, of deep selfless service rooted in his heart for Ram and Sita. And those stories are sure to come. So Jaya Hanuman, namaste.